5 traffic, Gulf Lima Alpha is taking off runway 06, VFR to Edinburgh 2000 feet. Edinburgh traffic, runway clear, uh, 83, everyone. Got 65 knots and rotate. Uh, positive climb, gears coming up. Up by five. Okay, 78 knots, 300 above, flaps coming up. Power back to 25. And 2,500 pop RPM. Continue the climb, turn around to the right. Head towards Kelsey. Right, so I'll continue around then head to the east. Passing 1400 feet, stick stay around this level. Right, that's runway. Okay, let's get power back to 23 and 2300 RPM. Oh, <laughs> that's doing the pizza heat for some reason. Some control miss mismatch there. Okay, here we go. Right, fifteen hundred feet. We don't want to go higher than that, really. So continue now towards Kelty. Yeah, I can't really see very much. What we'll do is we'll get Edinburgh's free, uh, ILS tuned in just in case we have to use it. Uh, so it's one zero eight decimal nine. Right, let's tune that in on nav one box one zero eight decimal nine. Okay, we now have a DME readout for that. Okay, got to stay under this cloud base if we can. Heading now towards the Lockhorn Meadows, which are these, uh, this big lake thing here. And I think I can see the main road, which comes past Kelty here, going on to the motorway at Junction 4. Just about visible. Okay. Let's see if any other controllers are online. And they are not, so we'll just continue on Unicom. Right, and when we get to Kelty, we'll continue down the Kelty VFR lane towards Edinburgh. Okay, watch losing a bit of altitude there. Staying under this cloud base, don't want to go too low either. Okay. Now approaching Kelty. Yeah, yeah. Overhead Kelty now. Let's get the landing light, my landing lights off. In fact, I'll keep my landing lights on because of the low visibility. I want traffic coming north to be able to see me. So now overhead Kelty. So as we cross over the motorway, we'll start our turn south. Just heading here towards Blair Adam Wood. Blair Adam Forest. Right, here's the uh, motorway, a bit of traffic on there today. Okay, let's start our turn towards the south. Head over um, Lock Fitty here, this big lock straight ahead. 
Okay, try and maintain this height. I'm just come just to the west of King's Seat, so just the village, just here on the nose, okay, just to the left of the nose, I should say. Edinburgh traffic, Shamrock 57 Echo Bravo, departing runway 06, Edinburgh. Okay, I'm going to have a look on my app now to see if I can uh, see any other traffic in the Edinburgh area. I, I would be very slow on the ILS, so I'd need to be very careful. Let's have a look. Okay, so we do have traffic heading for Edinburgh here. Uh, we've got at least a couple of planes heading for Edinburgh. Sorry. We'll keep to the right of this motorway. Okay, if we head directly south now towards the bridges. So this building here is the big Amazon depot. I think it's either a size of 11 or 14 football pitches apparently. Right, I can just about see some bridges on the nose, so that's good. So we've got an easy jet. I'll probably let this EasyJet guy go first. Okay. Maybe we'll try and get in a little bit ahead of him. Okay, so if we do a heading now of about... Two one zero. For the traffic, easy six eight Juliet Alpha turn and final runway zero six. Okay, maybe not. Edinburgh traffic, Golf Oscar Romeo Lima Alpha is going to orbit over the bridges. Negative contact with traffic. Okay, watch the height here. And Edinburgh, Golf Lima Alpha to Easy 68 Julia Alpha. What's your DME, please? We are 10 miles out. Roger, copy, thanks. Right. Do a nice orbit or two over the bridges. Okay, watch and height, just lost about 200 feet in that turn. Let's come over the rail bridge. A few white horses. No, not really. Actually, there's not too, not too gusty down there. Little, a few little white horses on the sea, but not many. Right, just coming in over North Queens Ferry now. Right, let's come into the downwind now. Edinburgh traffic, Golf, Oscar Romeo, Lima Alpha is a PA28. I'll be joining for a left downwind behind Easy 68 Juliet Alpha. I'll try and keep in uh, nice and tight behind. So 
So I need to be able to actually see him first. I'm just coming down in now. There's the field over there. Yeah, very, very tricky uh, conditions today. I'll try not to use uh, autopilot if I can help it. Where is the traffic? Where is he? Edinburgh traffic, Golf Lima Alpha requesting easy jet position. Just about over the threshold, easy, 68 kilo alpha. Roger, that's copied. Uh, Golf Lima Alpha's turning in visual behind. I'll try and keep the speed up. Roger, we'll try and vacate it, Charlie. Uh, uh, Roger, no rush. Uh, I'm, I'll be quite slow on final. Okay, let's get the speed back. Right, so watch the ILS now. So landing lights are, yeah, landing lights are on. Okay, watching the height. Right, one stage of flap, actually two stages of flap. And get the gear down as well. Right, watching the speed and the altitude. Traffic easy six eight Juliet Alpha vacate the runway zero six. Edinburgh traffic Golf uh, Lima Alpha shortly turning three point seven mile final zero uh, zero six. Traffic trends over here, 69061, ILS 06, we're at 8 miles. Okay, I did completely mess that up. I think here we have 06 down there. Right, prop full forward. Final stage of flat. Edinburgh traffic, Golf Lima Alpha's one mile final. I'm going to try and vacate at Bravo in this PA28. Bit low. Oh, here's the realistic turbulence coming in. Watching the speed. Oh, buff it, buff it, buff it. Okay, 
Okay, this is fun. Flaps away. Okay. Golf Lima Alpha is vacated from E06. At Bravo. Okay, let's turn around and watch him land. There he comes. Whew, that was close. That was tight, but it was good fun. Just see if any ground controllers online, and they are not, so that's good. <sighs> so, time for another another bit of food. There he is. Nice one. Ah, I think we'll just call it a day there. <laughs> 